And uh, what you find is when you're using uh, gluten intolerant flours, they don't seem to have the, the gluten gluten mm -hmm. that you're looking for. Mm -hmm. You put in the xanthan, it suddenly gives you that same feel that, you mm -hmm. have, that you're used to using. Right. And, and it helps and you rise. And the mouth feel too, yeah. Yeah. right? It, yes. It's, it's brilliant in that respect. And it's a, it's a natural product. It's not something that's, you know, yeah, some yeah, little chemical brilliant. brew. It's, it's a very natural product and it's, it's great to not only thicken sauces like that, but for salad dressings, things that normally might have wheat starch in them. Um, the xanthan gum just does great things. Yeah, no, because I'm doing a road show at the moment for the Seed Ex Society of Ireland, all over Ireland. Really? Uh, yeah, so, so because my food, <laughs> I don't use a lot of, mm -mm. a lot of things. I know Sarah's here, where's Sarah? There you are, Pat. Mm -hmm. How are you? Uh, is uh, gluten intolerant. Mm -hmm. So I think we had you on stage last year, but you can eat everything here today, Pat. So no yes. problem. Yes, good, 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 good. That so. makes a few people happy here, right? Yeah, exactly. Yes. <laughs> That's awesome.